Now at four, clearing out the camp. Sacramento could soon force the homeless from the banks of the American River. The Sacramento City Council is meeting right now to vote on an ordinance that would do just that. And as you can imagine, it's creating quite the controversy. Good afternoon and thanks for joining us. I'm Julie Watts. And I'm Adrienne Moore. CBS 13's Marissa Perlman is live at City Hall with much more on this hearing. Marissa. Yeah, Adrian, it's a problem we first told you about last May. Homeless communities carving out into the levees, causing multiple problems, putting the city at risk for fire and for flood. Well, all of this comes to a head tonight, right here as the city council meeting goes on tonight. They're about to take on a big vote here any minute. Tonight, the city will consider an ordinance that would ban any camping within 25 feet of levees. Now, current law says governments cannot cite or tell people not to sleep in public if they can't provide everyone beds unless their camping disrupts public health or safety. Well, after our story aired last May, state lawmakers did draft a bill which would have given flood control districts the authority to remove these encampments, but that never made it to the governor's desk. Now, tonight's vote is an effort to protect critical infrastructure, prevent wildfires and catastrophic flooding as well. But some homeless advocates tonight are saying this ban, too, will be catastrophic. If you put this ban into effect, all these people are going to be brought up from the, from the rivers, put back in front of the businesses, back in front of the neighborhoods, and the police are going to sweep them every 72 hours. How is anybody going to get anywhere? We have significant concern with the concealment of the levee system with debris, tarps, tents that prevent us from achieving our core basic objective for levee protection. I cannot understate how important it is for us to be able to monitor and inspect our levy system every day. This uh, meanwhile, Mayor, Mayor Daryl Steinberg giving his thoughts right now. City leaders do call this a principal threat to public health and welfare. Now, again, public comment just wrapped up. We're hearing from city leaders right now. We're expecting a vote any minute. We will bring you the latest of this vote at 6.30 tonight. If this passes, it will go to, into effect within the next 30 days. Guys.